in this illustration, I uh, will be analyzing white light and YDSC. Here uh, we are given that uh, while coherent light having wavelengths 4000 to 7000 angstrom is used in YDSC setup, which is the visible range of white light approximately. The slit separation is 0.5 mm and the screen is 50 centimeter away. We are given that there is a hole in a screen at a point 1 mm away from the central line. We are required to find which wavelengths will be missing in the light coming out from the hole. So, here we can analyze first for missing wavelengths. We use destructive interference. at the location of hole in a screen. Now, in this equation first, if we calculate the path difference, we already discussed that in YDSE, at a distance x from a screen center, Path difference in interfering beams is this we write as small d x by capital D. In this situation, we calculate the small d is 0 0.5 into 10 to power minus 3. X here is 1 mm, that is 10 to power minus 3 divided by capital D is 0 0.5 here. So, this gives us 10 to power minus 6 meter. Now, for destructive interference uh, as we have written, this part difference should be equals to an odd multiple of lambda by 2. So, this should be equals to 2n plus 1 lambda by 2. For missing wavelengths in whole. So, in this situation, on slightly rearranging the terms, we will get the value of lambda is equals to this 2 into 10 to power minus 6 divided by 2n plus 1. Now, here we can see when this is the wavelength which is missing at this point. And we are given that the light is having wavelengths all from 4000 to 7000 angstroms. So, we can find out the limit on this value of n for all these wavelengths. So, if this is 4000 angstrom, say, this implies we are getting the value of 2n plus 1 is equals to this 4 into 10 to power minus 7, rearranging these terms, we will get 2n plus 1 is equals to 5. And if this lambda which is 2 into 10 to power minus 6 divided by 2 n plus 1 is equals to 7000 angstrom c, and this implies the value of 2 n plus 1 we are getting is 2.8. You can simplify and verify the values which I am taking. That means from 4000 to 7000 angstrom this value of 2 n plus 1 which is an on odd integer will vary from 2.8 to 5 and this implies missing wavelengths will be corresponding to two n plus one is equals to three and five as it varies from two point eight to five so here uh, there are only two odd integers which are possible between this range those are three and five so here uh, we can continue and get the value of lambda one which is for uh, the value five and for the value three so this is two into ten to power minus six by three which is equals to six 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 seven point six seven angstrom or you can simply write six 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 seven angstrom 
and other wavelength is 2 into 10 to the power minus 6 divided by 5, which is 4000 angstrom. So, these are the results of this problem. These two wavelengths will be missing between 4000 to 7000 angstrom, which will have destructive interference at the location of this hole, which will not come out from the hole.